So many trees here in Maybe still have purple ribbons tied around them in honor of Chelsea. And now that her body has been found, people here say they want justice. It's been on everybody's mind every day. And now everyone in the small community of Maybe wants to know who killed Chelsea Brock. May God get him. Last night, Monroe County Sheriff's Office confirmed the news. The human remains found in a wooded area in Ash Township are that of Chelsea Brock. The 22-year-old was last seen at a Halloween party in Frenchtown Township, wearing a poison ivy costume from the movie Batman, and friends say she made it herself, sewing each vine on by hand. At Olga's at the Mall of Monroe, where she worked as a hostess, a basket full of ornaments with Chelsea on them, a bag full of ribbons, and a purple bow tied around a column, all in honor of Chelsea. I feel bad for the family because really it all ended last night. You know, when they got the news, there was always hope that she was still alive, but now the hope is gone. I pass their house every day coming to work, and I miss that Chelsea Brook, and I thought about her every day. And on Facebook, a post from Chelsea's family, thanking everyone for their efforts in the search, and while the search for Chelsea may be over, the search for her killer is just beginning. Things like that happen everywhere, but in a small town, everybody knows everybody, and everybody goes to church together, and everybody just knows, you know, so. It's, it's tough. It's like one of your own. And I talked to Chelsea's manager at Olga. She says she was very outgoing and friendly to everyone she met. In Maybe, Camila Mary, 7 Action News.